All right, so today I'm going to be teaching how to make small hay bales just like this. So it's very simple. You have to find twine just like this anywhere. I got the hardware store for two bucks. And then you just have to take some scissors or a knife whatever is more comfortable for you you have to very very smallly chop up the twine <coughs> excuse me and then when you've chopped a lot you need more than this but i have a whole cup already you're gonna remove everything and then Take some tape. Any tape works. If it has a matte finish, that's better. <clears throat> You're going to want to lay it across so the sticky side is on the top. Alright, so I have the tape laid across here, just like that, and then you're going to want to take all of your cut up twine and just take it and dab it onto here. Along the entire thing. And then, as you can see, it's in clumps, so you just kind of just want to take all that as much as you can, and then cut it off. Flip it upside down. Shake it pretty vigorously. And then, this you can collect just for more. I'm only showing you how to make two small ones. And then this is where it gets a little bit more difficult. Yeah, this camera views better. So you want to take some tweezers. I just have these. These are bent. But if they're straight, it's better. <clears throat> then you want to take it and put it right onto here. And <clears throat> excuse me. And just start Twisting it, make sure that the twine is on the outside. And just keep twisting it. Alright, as you can see, I'm almost done. And the reason you use the tweezers is to get that nice, really tight hold on it. And you're going to want to be careful because when you're done, it's going to want to unwind on you. So, once you're just about done, you're going to want to put some glue right along here and then glue it. I use hot glue just because it dries faster. So hot glue it I took my tweezers out and you have something this big, which is a little bit too big compared to a person. So what you're going to want to do now <clears throat> is what I just do is I just take scissors. You could probably cut it with a knife. And you hold both ends. Just keep slowly cutting. You'll feel it when you're starting to cut through. And just like that. And I'll have two. As you can see, it's very... It's nice and tight. It looks good. It's way better size to a person than before. And there you go. Enjoy.